getting very great settings, but... That's true. Okay, so this isn't a really big update. It's more or less just AMD teasing the big Navi graphics card, and they actually did it with an Easter egg inside of Fortnite, which is really weird. Um, and, like, there it says something about something big is coming to the AMD Battle Arena. That's really weird. What's well, code name for Big Navi? Big Navi. Uh, but you know what? AMD, 6,000 series GPU. Uh, it looks like the release date for these are relatively soon. Um Honestly, I know AMD is probably going to sit there and try to be like, hey, we're going to compete with the uh, NVIDIA release. Honestly, I hope they come out with good value for money cards more than anything because that's yeah. where they really do compete is having the budget sector covered. Um, but as long as they don't try to go toe-to-toe -to -toe with um, NVIDIA on like the top-of-the-line cards, um, if they try to compete with like the 3070 around that price point and they make something decent, then sure. But all the rumors were saying that the top-of-the-line new amd card was going to perform like a 2080 ti so <laughs> if that's what it's going to look like and they do price it at 3070 then maybe they have a competing card there but um i, I don't know it's still still kind of hesitant which i mean to be fair i feel like the well now they're the 3080 is going to be like very consumer friendly but i wouldn't mind just seeing um you know just something that has really good driver uh compatibility and something that's constantly updated mm -hmm. um just a card that's budget friendly and is cheaper than some of the NVIDIA cards, yet performs slightly better than some of their budget cards. We love the 5700 XT, the 5700. Those are awesome cards. Because compared to the 2070 Super, I mean, it's, it's just, about the same. Yeah. And it lets Way you know, cheaper, usually. Yeah, if you don't want those like extra features like the NVENC and stuff, then yeah, it's an awesome card to go with. Um, but I mean, these really aren't any, like, this isn't a major rumor update. It's more or less just general discussion about it coming pretty soon, which I would love to see it because we want more PC builds. We'll have a ton of awesome PC builds we can do, uh, with this stuff. But yeah, I guess our, our hope is that they do come in at around the $500 price point. If they do, I mean, Hey, you know what? That's gonna be pretty, pretty awesome.